let's start with what is sustainability sustainability is very critical to understand it first emerged as an explicit social environmental and economic ideal in the late 1970s let's see first the definition of sustainable development it has been defined by the brentland commission in its famous report called our common future also known as brentland report in 1987 as the development that fulfills the needs of the present generation without compromising the ability of future generations to meet their own needs and the development thus achieved is the sustainable development and the property belonging to the processes and the system is called sustainability it's about long term thinking with respect to resource consumption and waste disposal in order to preserve the livable conditions on the earth for a long time to understand it in simple terms let's take one example suppose there is one very big magical pot in which every night two gold coins are deposited and it is up to the user in the next day to take out coins to use for his or her daily expenses the maximum coins that can be accumulated in pot are 100 coins means every day it gets filled to 100 coins by addition of two coins at start that person uses only one coin as his needs are very limited but after that his needs increase and he begin to take two coins up to this two coins level the pot remains full as two coins are deposited and two coins are expended every day and so the balance is maintained but over the years when the needs of that person are increased beyond two coins now he takes out three coins each day addition of two coins and removal of three coins means net one coin is removed each day this will deplete the pot in 100 days in 100 day the pot will be empty during this process slowly the stock of coins in the magical pot decreases day by day and once the pot becomes empty it cannot add even its two coins also and this diminishes the magical ability of that pot to deliver even a single coin in the above example we can relate the magical pot to the nature which provides all our basic necessities such as air water food and the climate that is necessary for our existence but we are now extracting more than the capacity of nature to fulfill our needs and here comes the role of sustainability if we consider each new day as a new generational time then through generation by generation the capacity of that pot to fulfill human needs is decreasing and ultimately one day exhausted so here comes the question what should be the optimal consumption the optimal extraction that can be drawn from that pot and that is sustainability being this case is very simplistic for our understanding actual natural systems are far more complex and interrelated but in this case of magical pot sustainability is system that maintains the amount of extraction to two coins which can be extracted up to infinite time without affecting the ability of that pot to give us two coins to sustain the living of future generations but does this guide us to choose our everyday actions whether they are sustainable or not well exactly no it requires some more efforts we will deal with that in our coming videos now let's see etymological history of sustainability means how the word came into existence the concept has been in use from old days as early as 17th century sustainable and sustainability both derive from latin word sustainere which is combination of sub means up from below and tenere which means to hold maintain support sustain or endure from latin the word came to old french sustenir and modern french as soutenir from here it came to english as a verb to sustain adjective sustainable came to usage around 1965 and the noun sustainability in 1970s the focus of this early definition was only about ecological sustainability but later on the scope of the concept widened to accommodate more diverse issues as below 
Classification of Sustainability Sustainability can be classified into three types Ecological, Economic or Social These three types are broadly the classification on the basis of which of the effects or processes we are looking at. You need to see sustainability through the C, S E E for S social, E environmental or ecological and E for economical.